Nowadays, uh, amateur observations are uh, very important for astronomy for uh, several reasons. The first one is that uh, amateurs are really professional. They can uh, manage uh, very modern uh, instrumentation that uh, only few years ago were uh, only in professional observatories. I tell it about uh, CCD and uh, very accurate procedures of uh, timing which permit to perform measurements of positions of asteroids with an accuracy which is uh, well b better than uh, any optical instruments, few milliard seconds or fraction of milliard seconds uh, are achieved simply by observing the timing of an occultation. So this kind of work is uh, very useful for uh, astrometry mainly because professional astronomers do not have time for doing uh, that measurements and do not, do not have even the possibility to be all over in the world where these uh, phenomena occur. So a network of uh, professional amateurs is more than welcome for uh, astronomy and uh, the role of uh, the observatory Sylvester II in Bukovets is crucial in this uh, panorama, in this international uh, panorama, because it gives a reference for uh, Northern Europe for this kind of study and uh, it will be a gathering point of uh, all observers from uh, former East Europe. Bukowiec Observatory dedicated to Sylvester II is I think a cornerstone in the dialogue between science and faith. Uh, the reason is the following. Sylvester II has been a Pope and he has been as well a scientist. But in the world of science, the fact that he is a Pope has been considered always like a limitation and conversely in the world of faith the fact that he was a scientist was not completely understood. Now the fact that an observatorium is dedicated to him gathered together the science aspect and the aspect of the man of faith because of the unity of, the, of this personality. It is possible to do astronomy in the name of him and in the same time to know his spirituality as man of faith Benedict, Benedictine monk and afterwards Pope.